Salam, salam. This is Unity, and I'm here to do another K Nora Designs jewelry haul. So, I finally got to look through the box, the box, and oh my god, it's so much stuff, y'all. I found gold pieces, silver pieces, diamond pieces. I found a lot of stuff, and I want to share some of the things that I found with y'all that will be on KNORDesigns.com. And thank who, thank you all that have purchase something from that site that particular site and i'm still adding more things like i say that site gonna build up my mom i'm bringing another box it's so much stuff and some of the stuff i'm not even keeping i'm just giving to her because i'm like the type of person if i'm not going to use it or if i'm not going to sell it or i did make a, a pile for a giveaway so we will i will be doing a giveaway soon along with my hand painted earring i haven't done it giveaway in a while so hopefully um, June, July, we'll, I'll be doing a giveaway. So I want to show y'all some of the the um, vintage. These are vintage pieces. They are vintage pieces. I looked some of them up, found out who they were by. This, this mood ring. I'm like, dude, I love stuff like this. I don't know what my mood is right now, but it's it just go with me. I love the spiral. Okay, so let me show y'all what I got. Um, these pieces. It's a lot of vintage pieces. It's so much stuff. Like I say, it get, it's kind of overwhelming. I wish I kind of had somebody to like go through it with me and put everything together and all that. But my mom, she do her own thing. My sister kind of do her own thing. And they, it's like 50 boxes. So everybody got a box and they kind of go through what they want. Like I go through what I, this is what I do. I went through what I wanted. And then I gave her back what I didn't use because I'm not just going to have something and I'm not going to use it. Even though I make stuff, but I have a lot of stuff. So I don't want to just hold on to something that I'm not going to use. So, and then she bringing another box over here today because we got like really, really bad weather here in Florida. So she bringing another box because she's out in the country. So she's coming over to stay tonight. So I literally was up to like four o'clock in the morning looking through that stuff, y'all. It. It was, it's, it was overwhelming. But this is the first piece, pair I want to show y'all. I told y'all earlier that I had found some real diamonds, some real gold, um, real pieces. Now, this one of the pieces that I decided to sell, I don't know if this real gold, but it if it's not real gold, it's a really good quality. It's a really good quality of gold. And they're really pretty. It's like two little angels. In a, in a um it's a pearl up here and then it's a, a rose yeah so this is the first pair and it's going to be on knor designs i even made some little cards that say knor designs i made these if y'all want to know how to make these little cards i'll show y'all if y'all want to so that's the first pair i'm gonna show y'all these right here because it's a lot of this stuff named this and i i had to look this brand up to see what it is and it's like a it's a old older it's a vintage it's a vintage jewelry company that makes a lot of different types of jewelry and i'm pretty sure y'all heard of it um it's called monet and i looked it up and this if you look up monet m-o-n-e-t jewelry you'll see it and the um the stamp is engraved in it so i have a lot a couple of, of pieces of this monet um jewelry but i haven't um I'm just going to show y'all this one because I need to, um, I need to find a couple of other pieces to some, but I got a couple of pieces of this. So this, I haven't put this on a card yet. If y'all can see these, they're very good, high quality, very good, high quality. Let me bring it back some. Y'all, I found a clip of the Monet jewelry because, like I said, it's a lot of Monet jewelry. But I found a clip, and I want y'all to hear this, which she said about the same thing I said. I just said it naturally. I was like, you could pass it on. But So I'm going to put this link in the description box so y'all can um check this brand of stuff out. So anytime I get the Monet jewelry, I'll let y'all know. It's really good quality stuff. Hold on. Cater to women going to work in a May classic, beautiful um, contemporary jewelry. Buying a piece of Monet jewelry was really a chic thing to do. You bought it and you treasured it, you, you wore it, and you saved it for the next generation. So Monet is a chic brand. 
So I'm going to put this in the description box so y'all can check this company out, okay? All right. Jewelry. You know, it's a lot of people starting to sell jewelry now and it be like kind of cheap. Not hating on nobody else, but I mean, it is what it is. But this is like an investment that you know that you could have some jewelry that you can pass on to to your loved ones. And this is a good quality. This is going to last. It's not going to turn at all. So this is a pair that will be on K-Nor Designs. It's, I have more because uh, I see a lot of this brand. And it's a really good high quality of costume fashion jewelry. So that's them. And it's just a little it latch and close. I could wear this kind of latch. I can't wear the other kind of latch that I told y'all. But these are so dope. So that's that. Yeah, it's a good quality. When I was looking at it, I was like, damn, these are some really good quality of jewelry. So that one. Then I'll show y'all some studs. These um, like I said, another great quality of jewelry. They, I don't know what brand this is, but it's some starfishes. And it's not cheap. It's a really good quality. I keep saying that because I, I, I know jewelry. I've been around my mom and dad been selling jewelry ever since I, they always had like a little store. So I've always been around. Like I know good quality jewelry. So these are some starfishes that got little diamonds all on them. I was trying to see was these sterling or whatever, but whatever they is, like I say, they're good quality, a good quality pair. They're not cheap. So that's them. And here go another pair um, of hearts, and they got like diamonds. Like I say, these really look they like sterling silver. I'm I'm not gonna put sterling silver on them, but it's a good quality. I'm you gonna hear me say that through this through a lot of these these videos. I don't know if these 100% sterling silver or white gold whatever, but I know that these are good quality. So you not I'm not gonna charge what I think because I don't know exactly what metal is made of, but I know it's not cheap. So this is a, some hearts. If y'all can see, see that. I wish it was focusing a little bit better. If y'all can see that. Okay. So I showed y'all them. And like this, these. Oh, I didn't even put a, a hook. Let me put a let me put a back on these real quick. So I could see what I'm talking about. The quality of this stuff is not like cheap. Like cheap. It's gonna be a reasonable price, but it's not like cheap quality fashion jewelry. It's really good quality. Like these right here. And they the back is um is pierce really pretty oh matter of fact i didn't oh i just took that off but yeah they like little leaves and they gold tone really good they's not gonna turn they're not gonna turn they're really really good quality and then y'all see these right here i got them in my ear let me take them out and i want to show y'all these i think these might have um like gold um diamond chips in them <laughs> keeping these for myself but these not the ones that i found that was i know for sure that's diamonds but if y'all can see that i want y'all to see what i see y'all see they got like diamonds right here they got diamonds right there i got all kinds of stuff but yeah these are very nice very nice this stuff is very nice i'm glad my mom shared it <laughs> and then i could share it with y'all yeah okay so what else i could show y'all so i showed y'all them them oh i could show y'all some clip-ons because i i have a lot of customers that um like clip-ons so this is a pair like i say very good quality not cheap i'm gonna pull this off y'all see the the craft craftsmanship of these very great quality like i said y'all gonna hear that because i was like amazed at the quality of this stuff very very nice beautiful you know we have someone pretty i mean just look pretty make us feel like a queen we're a queen without it but 
you know, y'all know what I'm saying. Wow. Y'all see how pretty this is? Let me just clip. Y'all can see that? So that's a clip on, and I will put clip on in the description box so you can know. These are very gorgeous. If I see somebody with some earrings on like this, I'd be like, dang, you got some beautiful earrings on. Beautiful. I don't know, when I'm looking at these, this jewelry, it reminds me of a child. Being in my mom, she had like a little small store in Jacksonville, Florida. And I, if I didn't tell you, I used to get, she used to have like these dollar earrings. But they kind of looked like, they was like it was in the 80s. And she was selling for a dollar. So I remember taking them to school and I was selling for, I was nine. And I was selling for a nickel. So it's like looking at these earrings, it just literally took me back to that time of selling some earrings in the ninth, I mean in the fourth grade for a nickel. And I remember going to the store and I had like all these 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 um pennies. I had all these nickels and I remember because candy back then, cookies back then was a penny. <laughs> and if I got five nickels, I could get five pieces of candy. So I remember, I don't, I don't know if I had a dollar or how, whatever I had, but I remember I was a little hustler and I was selling um, those earrings and I got caught. Um, I got caught by my teacher. He asked me, where you get those earrings from? He always used to mess with me. He was like, where you get those earrings from? Look at this girl, y'all. <laughs> wow. And my little hair on. Did y'all know this side was shaved? It's trying to grow back. Y'all know I'm a messy brain. But anyway, talk about the hair. Talk about the nickels, showing jewelry. The light, um, the mind of an artist, huh? Be all over the place, but we be all over the place, but we got it together to a point. <laughs> but yeah, so he told me I couldn't sell. He was like, "Where you get them from?" And I was like, "I get them from my mother's shop." And he was like, well, you can't sell them. I don't know who told them or how, how it happened. But that, I was just going to say something. Anyway, yeah. So I was just looking at this and it reminded me of that time. And it's crazy because I was nine when that happened. And at nine years old, that's the number of completion in numerology. And, and then so many years later, I start selling earrings again. So this was something destined to do. Okay. So what else I could show y'all next? Oh, I'm going to show y'all these. Now I look this person up, the, this designer up. His name is Edgar Burrabees. Burrabees, if I'm saying that right, if I'm saying it wrong, y'all can correct me, but I put it across the screen. I looked him up and he was an artist from the, he was an artist th that created jewelry and furniture and a whole bunch of stuff. And these are vintage. And I looked them up. Um, Yeah. And if you look right here, you can see, if y'all can see that, y'all can see his logo. It's B-E-R-E-B-I. His name Edgar. Burr, uh, I can't pronounce it, but I don't want to pronounce it wrong because it could be Jewish, it could be Arabic. I, you know, people spell it different because it got, I think it got like one of them little things at the top of it. So, um, yeah, these are made of enamel and a type of good quality. <laughs> Y'all gonna hear that again? Good quality metal. This part over here feel like enamel and it's metal. And they're so beautiful, like, wow. To be honest with y'all, it's so much stuff I wanted to keep. I got me some stuff, but I, it's a lot of stuff that I'm not like a, a hoarder when it comes to things I will share. And um, I have some things that I need to get rid of. So that's going to be incorporated in the giveaway. So I'm not like, you know how some people like me, me. I'm pretty sure some people, if they see a lot of jewelry, they try to keep it for themselves. But I've been around jewelry and all that type of stuff all my life. So it's not like, and I make it. So it's not like. I, my eyes did get big. I'm human. I'm a woman. I like beautiful things. But I was just like, you know what? I want to share. So these. And if you go on Etsy, you'll see these. If you go on, if you put his name in. I think I've seen two pair similar to these. But I know that mine's a more original because it has these original studs up here. Yeah. Okay. So that's those. 
another. I'm mainly going to show y'all just earrings. Y'all know I'm an earring person. What else I can show y'all next? Oh, these right here. I'm trying to see what brand is these. I'm thinking these might be the be that Monet lady again. Oh, I see something. These are really, really good quality. I need to get a magnifying glass. Is that the Monet lady or is that 14 gold? I don't know now. Is these 14 Gary gold? Now, if somebody get... Wait, these the Monet. These Monet. Yeah, these Monet. That is... They so nice that it... Yeah, these Monet because the back say it. It's so nice. Y'all probably can't see that. But right there on that, it say Monet. And then right in here, it says, wait, let me show y'all the earring. I had it on the thing, but I took it off. Let me put it back on because y'all can see it better with the um, black background. Yeah, this is another um, pair of Monet. I, I like good quality stuff. I, I, I have an eye for it. So when I looked at them, I knew it wasn't like a... a um, a cheap quality I really looked at it and knew that these were really good quality and these that um, Monet artist I'm thinking this is an artist out of I can I did I try to do a little bit more research but I found out more before you know editing this video and I put it across the screen but this is her a him brand again but these was the ones this another Monet and you see the quality of this stuff this is not turning this is really good quality I want to show y'all the insides of these. And this is the... Some of them, I, can, I don't have the original these, but I'm looking more to find them. But this is the original everything. This is the inside. Y'all see that? It's some writing right there, but I can't hardly see it. Holly, I can't even... I cannot see it. It's so tiny. I'm going to get a magnifying glass. Yeah, so these are beautiful. Very elegant. Oh my god. I love pretty things. So I showed y'all them, showed y'all them, showed y'all them. Did I show y'all these? And is let me see if these what brand is these? I don't know if these are brand, but they're really good quality too. Let me Y'all see these? They gold. And it's just a little swirl design. Really pretty. Yeah, these are pretty. They're, I couldn't wear these because I could feel the heaviness. Like, um, I could wear them, but like these right here ain't bothering me right here. I don't, um, when I was young, I used to wear heavy earrings and they kind of pulled this ear down. So if y'all notice, that one sit up and this one kind of go down a little bit. But I know these right here probably be a little, a little heavy for my ear. But like I say, they're very good quality. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'm so happy to get to share this with y'all. Um, so we show, okay, here go another pair. And this is like enamel. See how beautiful those is? It's like a enamel, and then they got like this. Let me show y'all this inside of it. So y'all know this stuff ain't like cheap. This ain't no Dollar Tree. This ain't no really good quality. Okay, I think I'm gonna put really good quality. <laughs> quality in the um, things I've been seeing that okay so let me show y'all these I can show y'all all three of these together again great quality these are some is these the Monet brother I don't know who they is but they some like hoops 
and they pierce back and then they got like really pretty good quality great quality <laughs> that's one and then here another is another one the same not cheap good quality and then here another here's here go another pair. This the latch I was telling y'all that I can't really mess with because it, it some reason latches like that mess with my ears. And maybe because it was the cheap ones, I don't know. Maybe you know the little dollar ones that be having those little latches. Maybe it won't bother my ear. I never. I might do. I might get a pair of these and see because these are really pretty. Y'all see those? Like I say, all this stuff is beautiful quality. Oh my God, I love jewelry. Jewelry make me happy. Jewelry, nature, food, some people, <laughs> books, um, beautiful things. I think one time I, I told somebody, I said, um, I send many, I think I told them, I send many blessings to you. No, I think I said, you are as beautiful as the word. It's all the beautiful things you can think of in your mind. Something I said, but it, I don't know. I just think beautiful is just so many different levels. It's not just like beauty. It's like the soul and the, like nature is so dope to me just watching it. And it can be, you can look at nature and see some things. You can be like, wow. Because I look at animal planet a lot, y'all. Well, I ain't looked at it in a while, but I used to make my kids, when they, when they got, and I got aggravated with them, and they was being bad, I'd be like, go downstairs and look at the animal planet. They'll go downstairs and look at the animal planet. After a while, they start liking the animal planet. Okay, now here goes some more. These are some pretty, like I said, they kind of heavy. These won't, even though they're kind of heavy, they won't bother my ear. I just know they got weight on them. They're not like, like I say, cheap. They good, good quality. I was going to show you. Oh, let me see. Let me show you all this. I think this is, I'm thinking that this is gold. This is a lead, and then this is a brooch. And then they got some writing right there. If it's not, it's like a very high quality. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, you see that lead? And I guess you can just put it, like, right there. It is so pretty. And then I'm going to show y'all something else I found in the box. An amethyst stone. Yeah, amethyst stone. It's all kind of stuff in those boxes. Like I say, it's kind of overwhelming. You could tell... Like they just been packed for a while and um you have to go through it and like some necklaces you have to be real careful to make sure that they don't um you know um what they call it tangle now this is a, a piece that i know is gold for sure that that was in the box i haven't found the other one yet but this is like gold on this side. And the beautiful part, I remember these earrings. If I could, under my nails. That's why I cut them. I don't care about them breaking because they grow. They, they like claws. They grow. They, um, excuse me if y'all see any paint in my nails because y'all know I've been painting. <laughs> they'll grow and then they'll break. And then like a couple of days later, they done. So y'all see, y'all literally see this. Now I'm going to show y'all this again. I'm going to show y'all this thumb. In about oh, two weeks. And y'all gonna see how long that nails. It's kind of creepy. They grow really, really fast. So let me show y'all how this. When you take the thing off. It's like the heart kind of break up. You see that? And then you put it back on. I haven't found the, the other one yet. Yeah. But that's. I know this real gold. I know it. I, I know River Gold. This is probably a white gold. But this is gold. Even the back of it. You can tell by the um you can tell by the this right here. That that's original. So I haven't found the other one of that oh, so much. Okay, I think I showed y'all everything. And guess what? If I didn't, I could always come back and do another video because I think these videos gonna be consistent. Um, because it's a lot of people like different types of jewelry. They like, you know, 
the Afrocentric. They like the oh I got I do I got one more pair to show y'all. They like all different kinds of jewelry. So I'm gonna show y'all this pair. And this is a clip-on pair. And like I say, good quality. I thought of prints when I seen these. And they're clip-on. They got little dubs. And these are very dainty. They're not even um heavy. Very dainty. So I don't know if them that's real gold down there, but I know that if it is, it's a good gold plated. So these will be on the site. So, all right, fam. I'm finna go. And if y'all see anything that I showed in this video and it's not on the site, bear with me, y'all. It's it's like kind of overwhelming, and I'm doing all this by myself. I'm running my business, my household. Um, I'm doing all this by myself. Well, not all by myself. I'm doing it with the will of the God and me and the God in the universe and my supporters. So I'm not by myself. But, you know, when you it's a lot going on. You feel like you're by yourself. So bear with me by putting this stuff up. So if it's anything, if y'all want me to do a quick, that y'all see that y'all like and it's not on the site, please contact me in the email knoradesigns at gmail.com or boabw art at gmail.com and I will surely send y'all some invoices if y'all see something that y'all like alright thank you all thank you 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 just thank you I'm thinking everybody. I'm thinking ancestors. I'm thinking you. First, I'm thinking me. A lot of times we forget to think us. Thank y'all. All right, y'all. This video long. Y'all told me y'all like long videos. So, all right. Salon, salon. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want to show y'all these. I forgot to show y'all these. These are some silk flower earrings that were made in Hawaii in 1986 yep 1986 and they was made in Hawaii y'all vintage ain't they beautiful oh my god it's so much stuff alright y'all for real salon salon